hope you had a wonderful Easter and had time to enjoy some quality time with your family and friends. Since I updated you last in March, we've had some outcomes on a number of external factors which are traditionally perceived to affect the decisions people make when selling and leasing property. We now have an indication of the federal budget and a date for the federal election. Whilst these events can have a small impact on markets, most buyers and sellers are savvy in their decision making and choose to internalize their property decisions, choosing a time that is best for them, their budget and their lifestyle, as opposed to being driven by the external factors. This comes from people taking an interest in being educated about the property market, but also knowing that making a property decision before September generally means settling in by Christmas and for the new school year. Historically, April is a challenging month for leasing properties due to school holidays and consecutive public holidays. But this month has seen a record month for JT Allen in all areas, with increases in a number of properties leased, days on market and yields. The buoyancy of the rental market has improved considerably, restoring rentals to pre-COVID levels. We continue with our record-making sales success. In the last week, we have sold a number of properties in Vaucluse, Potts Point, Darling Point and Willara, with a notable achievement being a record building result at 27 of 6 Trelawney Street in Willara. We also achieved an outstanding off-market result at Etham Avenue in Darling Point, selling a three-bedroom apartment for 7.8 million, a record for the building and for the area. As always, please get in touch if my team or I can be of any further assistance to you. Mm -hmm.